What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're um, playing with the blooper pedal. I bought this joint like a couple months ago. Played with it a little bit, but I really decided this year I was gonna really get into it. So, seeing if we can't, you know, make a loop or figure out, you know, get something started using the blooper pedal. So that's what we're doing right here. It's just a loop I had already had and I just kind of dropped it in. It's just like one one or two sounds. I just went ahead and dropped it in the pedal. So now I'm manipulating it in the pedal, inside of the pedal right now. It's crazy, even the slightest turn of the knob will skew it, something crazy. Don't forget to like and subscribe, y'all, for sure. Uh, more content is coming. Um, definitely more gems I'm going to be dropping. Uh, so stay tuned. Man, I'm telling you, just the slightest turn of that knob will take, take it somewhere you don't want to go. So... Right now, I'm just trying to find something that sounds loopable, you know. Something that, you know, I could chop up and loop or I could, you know, use. At least for a starter sound or a lead melody. That could have been hard right there, now that I'm listening to that. sounds take me where it wants to take me sometimes that's the best way to work let God lead you That could have been a dope R&B joint right there. And like I said, I've used the pedal a few times, but I'm no expert, so bear with me. Now, right now, I'm just using um, the modifier um, Smooth Speed, I think it's called. The other modifier, I believe, is uh, Scrambler. So I'm using those two together. All right, I'm about to run it into Ableton. Okay, 
I think I got it. So now I'm about to chop it up. Um, it's a radio sample. And, um, you know, see if I can't get a, you know, a pattern. It's always some technical difficulty in audio music. Like it never fails. I know it's the story of our lives, isn't it? So now I got the lead line. Let's see if we can add a, um, a second uh, a cross melody to it or something that, you know, can play well with it. See, I like that sound because the mids in that sound gives it body. It gives the other melody some body. I don't know. I guess it's, it might sound hard to explain, but maybe it's not. I mean, it's like, you know, the, the lead melody is just the head down to the neck. Um, so the second melody would be the midsection, you know, be the body. You know, if you, you know, want to fatten it up. You know, that's, you know, makes it interesting. It gives it, you know, a little fat. It gives it some beef. Um, the arms are the cool little effects. Legs and stuff are the bass lines and, you know, and so on and so on. I could have came up with a better analogy, but whatever. So already sounded hard. You know, I like to pitch up and pitch down. I got mad plugins going right now. CPU is struggling, bro.
I've, I've already kind of got it in arrangement form, so I kind of have an outro and I have a little bit of an, um, an intro or, a, you know, a midsection, so, you know, I always say arrangement is key, arrangement is key. This joint turned out to be dope. Definitely. Um, I'm probably going to be using the pedal a lot more for this new pack that I'm going to be sending out. So um, I'm going to have a couple more videos like this. And um, definitely, like I said, more more videos coming, coming soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, Y'all stay tuned. I'm trying to find the audio. <laughs> I'll see y'all soon.